Fortuna. But right now, a good one. The WBA minimum weight title eliminator, Oscar Collazo de Villalba, Puerto Rico, in only his fifth pro fight. Opponent ready to make his ring walk into the red corner from Puerto Rico, Oscar Collazo. Oscar Collazo, y saludos a toda la gente en Villalba, Puerto Rico. Square circle, we're underway. Beto Duran, Zurdo Ramirez, and Scrappy Ramirez. And with you, ready for this one between Oscar Collazo, right. Victorio Saludar, Patrick right. Russell, Raul Cay Sr., and Ray Danseco, your judges. Collazo, the southpaw with the white gloves. The Filipino is Saludar in the red. And Collazo... Uh, step up here in his fifth fight immediately pushes back Saludan. Both of them came out the gate pushing. 105 pounds, the minimum weight. That's the voice of Sudo Ramirez. Scrappy Ramirez is 10-0 in his own right with eight KOs. What do you like so far? You got seen, he just switched stance. He, he perhaps saw something, but went back to cell phone. Saludar in the red. Are he's waiting for him to throw the, the, right, the right hand to take in the distance to throw the, the right and hook, right hook. Yeah. Oh, okay. for Coyazo. Coyazo going to the bottom here in the first round. Final seconds of the opening round. It's scheduled for 12. Put the, the football to hey, close the distance, close the distance. I he's, he's confident right now, look. Yeah, he, he seems very confident, so, and he should be. He's been here before. He has a lot, a lot of opinions, too, uh, uh, Saluda. Let's not forget this is a 12-round yep. fight. Yeah. So you got to you gotta set the punches in, you know, perhaps the game plan is to uh, take it to deep waters and then get to work. That means Saludar is punching. The, the only way to keep him off is by punching, you know, and sometimes that's a technique to take him to deep water and get him tired. But you see, uh, Salah, he only looking for the right hand. Colasso bleeding from the nose with 28 seconds to go in the second round. The Filipino fighter is a tough out. He's very confident. Landing his shots here in the second. Colasso needs to move the head a little more. Head, head. And he needs to throw body, the, the, the right into the body, and the uppercut with the left. And close the ring, close, 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 and get the distance. Good pressure. Nice counter by, by the Puerto Rican in white. Of course. Was well done, so that's that's where he has the experience. Colasso, led by Miguel Cotto. So he has Miguel, he has the name Oscar. You're like, okay, that's cool. Well, he was named after Oscar De Loya. Colasso's mom, big fan of Oscar De Loya, named him Oscar. Colasso was on Puerto Rico's Olympic team for the 2020 Olympics, but there was no... Looking for the ride, Saluda. But that's, you see? That's, that's what, that what you like right there. Good angle by Oscar. Nice shot by the Filipino. That's the price, that's the price you pay when you... Stay in front of your opponent and you're seeking to gas him out. Sometimes you take unnecessary shots, but there's a, there's a reward at the end. Like he's been on a roll. Body shot. I don't think uh, Salvador liked that body shot. He also goes back, hits him with the left, moves him back against the ropes. Good he combination. Good. Uppercut landed by Collazo, the Puerto Rican. That was a strong first half of the fourth round. I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, uh, I'm a lighter fighter. Light on your feet, right? Yep. Sounds are slips. And I like going to the body. Going to the body. Fin, body. With the head. Fin, jab. Fin again with the footwork. Look. I like his different way of uh, entering. He starts with the body, ends at on the head. That's a good uh, way of entry, Oscar. I don't know what they say, but they tell him they throw the jab. Throw the right, they say. 
Yeah, that's the corner of Saludar. Right. He's not throwing much. Moving Saludar back. So yeah, so he's controlling all the fight right now. He's controlling, I like. But he's going to do the full work. He needs to like close the ring, close the ring. It looks like uh, Saludar is taking the deep breath in the ring too, right? Yeah. He, he gets hit, then he takes a breath. Yeah, but sometimes you need to. You need to be. You, you need to know where you are, like in position, the position, position of the ring. Like sometimes. Oh, that body shot got him. Right. Saludar, the delay effect. He didn't go down, but they're gonna count it as a knockdown. And Saludar, the body shot to his left side was delayed, and he caught him. So Saludar with a standing eight. Goyaso jumping on it. Oh, yeah. oh, and a left from Goyaso. More body work from the Puerto Rican in white. Nice. Attacking the body. That's the plan. It's Goyaso. Saludar is trying to cover up. Oh, and Goyaso goes down. Saludar answers back. He hit him with the body shot. So the first time in his career, Goyaso goes down. So Saludar, desperate, answers back. Yep. And that's what I was telling you earlier about not being experienced, you know, being over aggressive. Yeah. You pay the price. Yeah. So how does Colossal answer back going down for the first time in his career here in the seventh? And Saludar, how much more is left in his tank? A left from Collazo moves back Saludar. Oh, heck of a seventh round. Colasso and Salador. Another body shot. Going upstairs is the Puerto Rican Collazo. Body work again. Salador. You want to see pressure from the Puerto Rican. Yeah, but, but it's smart. Smart, like smart pressure. Yeah. Smart pressure. Yeah. Smart pressure. Oh, that got him there. To the I caught him. Salador on the ropes. Trying to fight back. He's also covering up, though. He needs to be patient right there. He needs to be patient. Don't throw a lot of punches. How much is left in the tank is Salador. Those body shots are starting to take a toll. Deep press from the Filipino. And he answers with one body shot, does Saludar. Colasso with the uppercut, doubling it up, spins him around. Halfway through the eighth round. Coyasso needs to do two. But he's fighting back, Surdo. Yeah, Another he, solid he, round. You see, he, he gives the space, he gives the, the time to, to breathe. To do things, throw upper and body, upper and body. And As you see go. right now, he's controlling the range right now, you know? Yeah. Nothing, nothing too spectacular, just jab, controlling the range. But uh, Koyaso, he's lowing down now, and it's good for him because he needs to think. He needs to think the, the way there. He can, he can throw the punch and, 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 uh, and, and, got, and cut and don't get cut. Yeah. The copy box. You know, when the copy box numbers come out, you know, in his squad. And, oh, good shots landed by Goyaso. Two good rights. Straight punches, you know. Nothing too crazy. Hands are res up tight, being responsible. Look, yeah. he just got a reaction. Then he heard him. If he do the same thing, he won't. We will see it not come out. Yeah, but the position is all the time. Right there. Look, right there. Don't, let, 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 let it stay there. Look, against the ropes. No, keep him, against, keep him yeah. against the ropes. Okay. Look what's behind you. Open. Koyaso had to be smart, had to move around all the time. He's winning. And look, look at the body language. He's waiting for him, so he's ready. I like that. For the first By Oscar. time in his career, Oscar Koyaso in the 12th round. The WBA minimum weight title eliminator. The winner becomes the mandatory in the shot at the belt. Both fighters went down in the seventh. Goyasso's controlled the majority of this fight. The Saladar has been able to land some punches. He's been in the mix. It's not been easy tonight for either fighter. And in the 12th and final. What a great job by keeping his outside foot outside of uh, Saladar. Goyasso have the south point? Yes. That foot position can make your job a little difficult, you know, and just being aware. Uh, I mean, you see the results. So you need to maintain the distance all the time. That right there, yeah, lands like a solid yeah. left, knocks back the head of Saludar. Back to the middle. Positioning. You always want to be in a good position. Saludar is tough, man. Yeah, it is. 
Aquí está. No, mucho. Now they're just urging on. We're telling We hear Victorio's corner set telling him he's down on, on, on points. He needs a knockout. Last round. Do you pick that guy? A little bit. Poquito. <laughs> Not Spanish, man. Tagal is a little bit of Spanish. It is a little bit. There's some words that are there. <laughs> and they're telling him to keep on coming. Right hand from yeah. Collazo. Bang, bang. Nice. Oh, bang is I don't bang. know what that means, but bang, bang. Bang, bang is uh, old to Jim Lampy, one, man. Two. Bang, bang is one, two. One, two. <laughs> Matigas means tough in Tagalog. Yeah, I grew up in Carson, so I know some Tagalog words. I don't know much boxing. Uh, this round is, yeah. it's in Oscar's pocket already. You know, he, he already, he, he did what he was supposed to. You know, now it, it's, it's on him. All he needs to do is stay responsible with, yeah. uh, it's your fight. Yeah. He's in the pack already. He needs to just move, move, be smart. He doesn't need to raise nah, anything now. Salvador is tough, man. Nice. A lot of heart for him. A lot of heart for Oscar Callazo, who's feeling it good. The final second of the 12th and final round. A good scrap back and forth. Callazo and Salvador. What a performance. It's over. Tapusna, Walana. The fight is done. That means over in Tagalog right there. Nice. A good one between Oscar Collazo and Victor Saluda is going to go to the cards. And Judge Caiz scores at 118-110. Then Seiko, 116-112. And Patrick Russell has it 116-112. All for your winner by unanimous decision. Se mantiene invicto and still undefeated. El Borriqua, Oscar, El Pupilo. Mofongo. Mofongo. I, was, I was talking with him in the interview. He's like, I just want some mofongo, brother. Some tostones. He's ready to go. Get it, come He's going to eat really well when he goes back to Villalba, Puerto Rico. He is now the mandatory in the WBA minimum weight division. So congratulations to Oscar Callazo. It wasn't easy. He, he learned a lot because yeah. he went 12 rounds. He also learned how to react when he gets dropped. Yeah. Really important. A good quality round for him.